Abdurrahman. I'm a lecturer at a public university in Kenya. I deliver lectures in computing and informatics. Today, we are going to learn about a new topic altogether, and that it is object-oriented programming. In our last sessions, actually, we had learned about structured programming or introduction uh, to structured programming, whereby we had used C programming actually to demonstrate. We had actually went through about 100 videos actually to, to demonstrate the same. Today, we are going to start up a cool new topic on object-oriented programming. However, if you have not actually uh, uh, subscribed, please subscribe to Hodari Academy on a link below. Also, uh, uh, just be, make sure that you have also, also learned about the structure programming on our previous video before attempting up this. However, uh, this particular videos also they can be done alone. So let us start on to that particular journey. In our journey today, basically, we are going to introduce what the whole idea of this particular program is all about. What are we going to cover maybe in the next four or five months in this particular uh, programming language? So let us start on to that. So we had seen that uh, actually uh, we are going actually to take us onto a very big uh, program and this particular program basically we are going to cover around uh, all these particular topics so basically we are going to cover uh, our around these 10 topics and we are going to go through these particular topics one by one so uh, after this particular lesson we are going to start out with what we call introduction to java so our object-oriented programming is going to be based on the Java programming languages. So we are going to see the overview of Java. We are going to talk about the Java uh, Virtual Machine or JVM. And then we are going to see which will be the best IDE, that is Integrated Development Environment, for us actually to install and actually try uh, to implement object-oriented programming. And then basically we are going actually to see uh, uh, what we say uh, our first program onto that. After that, we'll go on to Java Basics. And on to Java Basics, actually we're going to talk about variable, data types, operator, and modifier. So from there, we are going to move on to what we call conditional uh, uh, and loop controls. Under that, as what we did on to uh, structured programming in C programming, we are going to talk about the if statement, if else a block, switch statement, the for loop, the while loop, and the do while loop. And then we are going actually to move on onto Java string, and we are going to see the inbuilt uh, functions of the string length, string, uh, string index, uh, index of uh, char art, and the compare function. And then from there, we are going actually to study about the object-oriented uh, concepts. These are unique for the object-oriented programming. We are going to talk about uh, classes and object, inheritance, polymorphism. Uh, we are going to talk about encapsulation, package, and interfaces. So that will take us on to those five topics. And then the next five topics, we are going to talk about memory management. So we are going to talk about garbage collection. We are going to talk about stack variable. And then also we are going to talk about the stack and the heap. Finally, we are going to talk about uh, exceptional handling. Under it, we are going to talk about the try and the catch uh, block. Uh, we are going to talk about the finally block. We are going to talk about the, how to customize uh, exceptional handling. From there, also we are going to talk about file handling just like what we did in a, a C programming, how to create a file, how to read a file, how to write a file, how to handle a file, and how to delete a file. So basically, that's what we are going to talk about. Then, finally, we are going to talk about collections. Here, on the collections, we are going to talk about array. We are going to talk about array list. We are going to talk about link array. We are going to talk about hash map, hash uh, sets. And finally, also, we are going uh, to talk about... Uh, uh, other types of collections and our last topic uh, 
are under this particular long journey, we are going to talk about enum, redex, and annotation. And onto that, we are going to talk about Java enum, uh, this, uh, and then we are going to talk about Java redex and Java annotation. So basically, this actually will be our topics actually to talk, which will take up uh, onto a very long journey, and this particular journey uh, will depend on ourselves because our first journey of 100 videos for our first uh, it took us uh, actually four months so also we are expecting actually in this particular journey also to take us four months so uh, this is our introduction until into our next video basically we are going uh, to say bye for now however don't forget to subscribe on to our next video Thank you and bye for now.